Now, in Unit 1, I introduce you to the context and relevance of the chapter. This unit is divided into three sections. Let's get started with Section 1, Context of Chapter 4. In this chapter, we address the research process. Different aspects of academic research are affected. The research problem, the research question, the research hypothesis, the research approach, and the research methods. Thereby, this chapter combines different aspects of academic research. Section 2. Relevance of Chapter 4 After the nature of academic research and writing, the implied academic principles and the underlying research logic were discussed, the next step is to elaborate on the research process. The context of this chapter is that an understanding of the research process is a prerequisite for the successful execution of every research project. Why is it relevant to have a look at the process steps of a research project? First of all, different research problems require different research approaches and methods. Thereby, a careful selection of an appropriate research approach and one or more corresponding methods determine the structure and the style of research. Section 3. Learning Objectives of Chapter 4 What are the learning objectives of this chapter? After this session, you should be able to understand differences and similarities of a research question and a research hypothesis. Furthermore, you should be able to define and to apply terminology related to the formulation of research questions. Additionally, you should be able to differentiate research approaches and corresponding methods. Finally, you should understand the characteristics of scientific styles and understand their impact on the research process.